Listen, fuck Traffic Mill Productions. I'm gonna get this out the way real quick, right? I'll be in the booth right now. Fuck a Traffic Mill Productions. I make my own beats. If I buy beats, they're from someone who better make a beats than you is. <laughs> Put it like that. I got a couple. I got a couple young boys. I got young boy. And I got old boy who nice as fuck. My old boy, he nice as fuck. You see what I'm saying? My old head, I buy beat from nice as fuck. I ain't heard nothing about you. This motherfucker already been signed with Brick Squad. Now he and now he with the GS9 imprint. So it's like, bro, what is you really doing? He ain't his beats ain't worth no three hundred dollars. This is a motherfucker who signed. I get it. It's a market where you set the price, but shit. Listen. <laughs> I told motherfuckers all the risk this, man. I'm not doing all this beef and shit. Oh, with some YouTubers, man. Listen, but then I thought about it, and I said, yo, but you been beefing with motherfuckers in prison behind the wall? You been in some street beef where shit gets real? You've almost died from beef multiple times. You know what I'm saying? I can't speak on anything else that's happened because of beef, because of legal ramifications, but I've been in a lot of shit. So this YouTube beef ain't nothing to me. Especially not with motherfuckers <laughs> trying to look like he fucking... What was his name? Michael and Mallory? What was, was that their names in the fucking Natural Born Killers? Dude got the rose-colored shades on, bro. Come on, man. Come on, man. Like, what is you really doing there? What is that? Come on. Let's just, let's just keep it all the way stacked. I ain't got time for all this. You the one who got time for going back and forth with me in the comments. Listen, I'm going to have some shit up later today. You a bum. Go fuck yourself. I'm going to actually go out and write a diss track. Just, you know who you look like? It's funny your name, Traffic Miller. You look like the motherfucker who killed Mac Miller. I had to mute your ass because I was like, you was just trying to comment back. That just showed me you not doing nothing. And like, keep in mind, I wasn't even dissing on you for nothing. I wasn't even hating. I'm not even hating at the same time. I gotta make that clear. I'm just saying, we in a fucking recession. You see, you trying to give motherfuckers the MSRP of what your beat is. Like, they can go resell that shit. They can probably resell it, not for no $300, though, man. Come on, now. They're not going to be able to do all that. We in a recession, bro. $50 ain't going to fill nobody's gas tank right now, bro. $50 is not going to fill your gas tank up. Okay? Just think about the type of economy you're trying to push this shit into. You know what made Wayne successful? Taking advantage of the free mixtape circuit during a recession making shit free during a recession right now we're in a recession and you know what you could go ask anywhere else around the youtube find a comment of me hating on something else find a comment because it doesn't exist bro i wasn't even hating i was just saying i was trying really i was trying to help you because what you're trying to do right now is really going a lead to other people being broke because they're going to put all the... Yo, you know how many people I've seen with no real musical talent? Really all it was is they did some time in prison. They put all their money into something and lost it, bro. And, like, I'm trying to prevent that from happening to people. You see what I'm saying? What you're doing is is in a recession. It's kind of, bro, it's kind of despicable, to be honest. 